Hey guys, it's Car Kids Zero One, and today I'm going to do a ripping ten. Uh, I'm not going. I'm going to show you the cards before I open them, and it's just show and tell. It's not going to be a speed challenge. So first we have the Ford F three fifty steak bed truck. Hot Wheels. I know Matchbox. You open from the bottom. Um, something sticking to the blister, but it's good. I absolutely love this model because of how the bed moves. You can take it off, put stuff in there. It's just a really cool truck. Now, I decided to rip one open on the camera because I already have like a ton of these. So, because it's actually like the first mass box car I hoarded. Now, there was one car that I ripped open that I forgot. Um, but it was this. I got this in the mail today. And package a super treasure hunt 2000 GT because I've always won one loose, but I should have saved it for the video. But I didn't because I have something else I will rip, rip on the video. Next, we have a Honda Civic EF, it's so dark. There you go. Um, the teal. I hate it when it does not. It's okay. Now, yep, it's good on both sides. Um, this is my favorite color for the EF. Ah, crap, really? <sighs> These stupid headphones. Um, sorry. Um, it's my favorite color. I'm not gonna restart the video because I already started ripping up my cars. Um. So yeah, it's my it's my favorite color that's released so far. The teal. Teal is my I mean I love blue and this color just matched the car perfectly for me. Next we also have another matchbox. A Porsche 911 GT3. This one came out like I think A case of 2014. So yes, let me focus. Okay, yeah, I'm sorry. Now this one I don't have multiples of, but it's okay. If it's a really nice matchbox car, I just open it anyway. I'll probably just put the blisters to the side because that's what made the camera fall over when I tried to throw the blister away. But here it is. Headlights, grill, tampon. Oh wait, is the grill tampon in the right spot? No, oh, that's okay. Uh, separate spoiler actually. That's not a rare, but. You can also see it on Matchbox. Um, painted taillights. It's a pretty nice car. Rolls good. I like how the lip is the same color. Orange. Next we have the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR. Dash R. Why is this so dark? I don't know why. Sorry about my lighting setup, I guess. Um, this, just because I don't have a ton of these. Because I actually like this better than the first edition, in my opinion. I kind of wish I had a chrome or black base, but it's okay. It matches the car. It's a really nice car. Definitely worth worth every penny. Yeah, every penny <laughs> that you pay for it. It's definitely worth it, in my opinion. Um, next we have the BMW E36 M3 race in red. I got this in my Q case. Um, so. Now, it's okay in red. I kind of like it in white better. There it is. It's mostly the racing decals. I kind of like the spoiler though. The spoiler looks cool. Sorry if I'm rushing, it's just I want to make the video not last as long so it doesn't take that long to upload. Next we have the Berserk. I got one in my case, but I wanted to get it because I thought it was cool. I don't really like that many fantasy cars, but this, this is pretty cool. It has a spinning saw blade. It rolls really good, actually. It's a 
pla wait, is that metal? Oh, this is metal based plastic body. And this is metal too. I'm not sure what this is for actually though. I'll have to look at the back of the card because I saved my cards. I just throw away the blister stuff. Next we got the Porsche 934 Turbo RS in orange. I love this car. I got, I was like six total. I got three in my case, so that's good. So, beautiful looking car. No taillights though, but it's okay. Um, sorry if my thing was long. Um, yeah, I just really like it. Look really good. Next we have the Carbonic. I got this in my case. I got two, and I'm gonna open one. Actually, you know, what? I had so many cars from my case that I could have saved for this video, but then I worked them like an animal, not thinking. So, okay, that definitely missed the trash can when I threw it in. The blister. Well, it's pretty good. It looks like it would be kind of good on the track. Uh, it has like this matte finish. Yeah, it's kind of cool actually. Um, now this is the special one. See, we have a regular twin mill, and then we have a super twin mill. I'm cracking both because this was up for trade for a, a trade 2000 GT, but then I bought it, and now I don't need this for trade anymore. So I'm gonna open it. So, see, for, for Hot Wheels, you always look for like a bubble where, you're, where it's not fully glued on the blister. So it's easier to open. I'm going to try to save the card. Really good. There you go. That, that's how I save it. Pretty good. Yeah, I just, yeah, if I try to pull it from the table, it's going to knock over the phone, so. Just the regular plastic wheels, black line wheels and everything, metal, metal. And here's the super. Where is the, oh, I can, I can, no, I want to try to rip it from the top. Yes, I know. I rip over my supers. I think it's more of a underrated super, even though it doesn't roll. Um, well, that's a downside, but it's okay. Okay, apparently, so apparently mine doesn't roll, but that's okay. I don't care; it still looks good. So I'll do a comparison of these two, and then I'll do a comparison of these two soon. So, yeah, this card to throw on, sign it up. 